All right, so real quick, I watched the video by Chun Chun that was posted on some of the things I didn't like. I just wanted to explore them further. So one of the things he mentioned was this vibrates when you go over bumps. I agree that's really loud and annoying, but I think it's just a design flaw or a trade-off that I think is bad related to them wanting to have this as a break or you know, also as serving to lock the bars when they're collapsed. Problem though is I think right here. So when you go over bumps, it's gonna hit this metal bar with plastic. And I think there's also probably some contact between these two plastic pieces. So I tried dampening it with a piece of Velcro. Velcro can work as a good dampener, but uh, I don't know. I think if you do that, it's going to compromise probably the lock integrity. So I think it's just a, a poor design choice. Um, and the other thing he mentioned was this gap here. So he thought it was quality control. I think it's by design. So if you look at the underside of this foam, there's no like mount, there's no obvious mounting schema here from that to go to that. And then if you look inside here, um, there's wire that I think connects to the charge port, probably to the battery or controller. But, um, sorry, it's hard to get in here. It has these sort of pillars that mount, but I don't think they're intended to mount to the underside of this because there's no obvious way that it would. It's not like there's a screw that's loose from missing. So it doesn't look flush. I think that's by design. If water did ingress into there, I think that's, they've addressed that by having these, what look like weep holes here, the ones without the screws where water could drain out. You can see like none of this external stuff is sealed. So I think it's just the battery that's sealed. And there is wire in there, but I think that wire is gonna be waterproof and probably where it connects the connection points, probably have some sort of um, gasketing or I don't know some reinforcement to, to prevent water because there's you know obviously wires here as well and there's probably some story where these underneath here are protected at their connection points if water were to get in there I tried just taking this off I removed these screws but <coughs> there's some attachment point here and then I think you have to really start to take a bunch of things off to get there so but yeah I think it's by design it just doesn't look great